we are back here with a real treat, an incredibly talented and funny actor, writer, producer, Aquafina, Golden Globe winner. People know her, of course, from films like Crazy Rich Asians and others, and her hit comedy central series, Nora from Queens. Well, now she is starring in Kung Fu Panda 4. Aquafina plays Jen, a small and scrappy fox who helps Poe, played by Jack Black, on his quest to defeat a treacherous new villain. But along the way, the sneaky fox creates some tricky situations. <laughs> oh, wow, look at the time. Remember, we have to do that thing down by the place with that guy? <laughs> Did you actually think you could grift a meal out of me? There's got to be some sort of misunderstanding here. And apparently I'm the one misunderstanding. Please allow us to pay for our meal and yours too. I'm only hungry for... Dumplings? Vengeance. Well then, come and get it. No, 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 no. don't come and get it. Destroy them! Awesome. Oh. <laughs> welcome to you. So glad to have you here. Good it's the fourth installment of Kung Fu Panda, but a brand new yeah. character here in Jen. Is she up to the task of fighting alongside Poe? I mean, I guess so. I think they're very different, uh, you know, statures. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> and, and yeah, it, it's, it's weird. I saw her for the first time when I went to the premiere the other day. And it's, it's crazy with animated movies to see them really come to life, you yeah. know? Yeah. And you got to act alongside Jack Black, who... Which kind of goes against how, I guess, voiceover acting normally happens. You mm -hmm. were in the booth together, which I, I feel like it makes sense to do it that way. We did it for, like, one day. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it wasn't, it was, I mean, like, he's right there. Oh, my God. I, I, it was so hard that day because I felt like I was ruining all his takes because he's so funny and I kept breaking. <laughs> um, and, and not only that, he's just, like, the nicest, realist real thing That's like awesome. he's yeah he's just awesome well and you get to play off each other's energy i would think totally right? but totally. you're you're a voiceover pro you have done everything in the book but yeah. you're doing something in an upcoming movie called if john crancy's new magazine yes you're voicing over an amorphous bubble bubble, a, a, a bubble. how oh. does one prepare for that amorphous bubble roll. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't even know. What, I didn't even know Who what that meant. Who did you channel? <laughs> when, I, when, I, when I went into the session, I was like, okay, sorry, what, is, like, what, is, what, is, what does it look like? And they were like, it's air. Yeah. And I was like, okay, okay all right. Uh, yeah, that, no, but, but no, it's, it's a bubble. And, and John Krasinski, amazing director, I think what he's, what he's going to come out with is going to be very, very special. So I was happy to be a part of it. And when you're not channeling air, I uh, think you've you. been spending a lot of time <laughs> on cleaning TikTok. Yes, Can dude. we talk about this? Yes, it's, you know, it's a kind of a dark, it's a dark era for me because I'm like doom scrolling <laughs> these, this guy, I want to shout out Jack Designs. I hope that he hears that. Jack Designs, is that him? But, I, oh no, maybe that's not him. But he's, um, he's like, he does all these things. Like he, and I, and I'm doing the things now. Like oh. he's like, he, he has a, the, the Dyson humdinger and he's like, He's like vacuuming. So you vacuum your. You're supposed to vacuum your bed, oh. and then he has this Bissell steamer, and he's steaming everything, dude. So you're totally he's steaming into everything. It now. I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's getting me to clean. So that's. Can I nice. have you come back from one of our I shop know. today segments? Yeah, uh, yeah. Have me. I love the new Bissell. So the last time you were here, we did random trivia. We right? did do. So we want to bring back trivia. I lost it. I had. I had. I was spiraled. Did you remember? <laughs> I like completely lost it during. Do you, yeah. Well, this time it's kind of based on a lot of different fowls because you've played now three bird type bird, characters. A lot, lots of birds up in here. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gilbert Godfrey has. I, I think if you do three more, I think you'll know, beat his that, record. I, I thought that I okay. I, you know, and I'm not. I'm not. I, I don't know, but I was. I, I was tagged in an, <laughs> an article of not obviously a reputable website in which it was like Aquafina just beat. But but the oh. thing is though, I was in Angry Birds, but I played a pig. Oh, okay. okay. So that's yeah, where so I that lost it. So, yeah, yeah. Either way, are you ready for some um, foul yes. trivia? <laughs> yes, I am. Okay. So question number one. You played a quail okay, in the animated movie Storks okay. back in 2016. I, I didn't research that. Okay. <laughs> okay. He had fancy machinery that made him stronger. Okay. But on average, how fast can a quail fly? Is it A, 30 to 40 miles per hour, <laughs> B, 40 to 50, or C, 50 to 60? A quail. A quail? <laughs> I mean, not my quail. Because B? B. No, it's actually A, 30 to 40. So 30 close. to 40? You can, you, that, that's, an un, that's an unsafe driving speed. What if a quail knocks into you? In the, yeah, in that's, the, that does seem very fast. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Don't fight the hypo. Yeah, 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 for sure. That's not even that fast. Watch out for those quails. Now we know. Okay, so you also voice Scuttle the Seagull in I the live-action version of Disney's Little Mermaid. I did. Seagulls are found all over the world, but which U.S. state claims 
the California gull as its official bird? Okay. Is it A, California, B, Utah, or C, Rhode Island? Rhode Island? <laughs> I feel like that's like a trick one there. Rhode Island. There are, it seems like there are seagulls like like I live with them, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I feel like there's so many They're seagulls everywhere. in LA everywhere. LA, California. No. What? That's why it's a trick question. Yeah. What? It is a trick question. B, Utah. Utah? Utah. I, know. I didn't Utah. make it. I don't know. Utah. Okay. They, like, they like salt. Here's your huh? chance to redeem yourself. Okay. Are you ready? Am I, gonna, Last I, don't, I don't think I'm going to redeem got myself. This. You got this. Okay. Last time you were here, you talked about your character, Chomp the Pigeon, in the <laughs> Illumination movie Migration. Yes. <laughs> their navigational skills make it easy for them to find their way home. Approximately how many miles can they travel? And what? still find their way home. A, 1,300. B, 850. C, 500. I wish that they found their way home and didn't return. You know, I mean, like, <laughs> they, 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 they don't get out of here. They're, they're no, they, they're they, no they, they don't leave the tri state area, dude. I know they don't leave the tri state area. Where okay. are they going? And B, B. <laughs> what? Are you, I'll, I'll never get hired as a bird again. A. I'll never get hired as a bird again. Oh, well, you made your mark as a bird. We learned. Yeah. We learned yeah. something. That was. So, I failed every single one of those questions. <laughs> we, we well, next something. time you're back, we'll have you. another trivia game for you. So, for Thank sure. you. I appreciate that. Hey, and guys, so Kung Fu Panda from DreamWorks Animation Studios is out in theaters today. Check it out. DreamWorks is owned by our parent company, NBC Universal. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.